So the first hat that I made was a bit too big. So I like to prototype out my designs and my apparel and garments for Prevail using existing fabrics and materials first to see, okay, what adjustments need to be made, things like this. So now that I've gotten that first hat out of the way, which was way too big, all right, I now know that I need to change my dimensions. And so I am doing just that. Now this sweater has this stuff on the front of it, which I'm not really interested in having on my hat. So you can see from start to finish how this process takes shape. All right, so I'm gonna turn this thing over. The seams of where the front and back bodice have been joined together are right there. And when it stretches, it's about nine. Same as the hat. Turn this inside out. I'm not cutting through both sides of the sweater, just the back side. All right, next side. All right, so now we've just got the solid blue without all the extra stuff. Cut as straight of a line as possible. Oh, poor sweater. All right. And that's out of the way. Now we have the material that we're actually going to be using for the hat. And if you fold these two pieces together, we've got about 16 at the stretches, okay? See, stretch, 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 stretch. But horizontally, this is where we have the bulk of our stretch, which is what we want for our hat. And now with wrong sides to wrong sides, do we want to make a line hat or no? Let's see what fabric we have. Do you want to use this or this is white, white, bright white versus like a winter white cream. But this bright white, uh, I think I'll use this one. Mountains. Wrong sides to wrong sides. 